Hi, today we'll be unboxing an AMD. This is a Ryzen 9 5900X. So this is the processor we discussed in a previous video and we'll be using this in a build. By the way, if you want to see the complete build at the end of these videos, make sure to subscribe. And of course, if you like this particular video, give us a thumbs up. So let's go ahead and open it. I mean, there's not much in here. You'll see it's a very light box, a little disappointing. And uh, so this particular processor, as is stated on the little sticker there, is a 12 core, 24 tread. Let's see. So it's a 4.8 gigahertz. And what's interesting is the box is actually pretty much empty. What they've done is they've put the processor on the side. It's a little bit unusual from a packaging point of view. Generally, I think most of you will also agree that logic dictates you'd want the product in the center so it's protected by padding and whether it's foam or cardboard. And then they've actually put it straight onto the side. So let's take a quick look. I mean, there's not something in here. There's no heat sink. There's a little document, but uh, as per usual, very light. So this is what you're getting. So we've got the processor. There's a little sticker on there. So if you're building it yourself, you're going to put this on your case. If you want to, of course, it's optional. And the processor, not very exciting to look at. The idea is that you want to drop this into a motherboard and this will be the heart of your new computer. Uh, the rest of the documentation really is about how to install it. Uh, this processor uses the AM4 socket by AMD. What's interesting is the AM4 was uh, also used on the previous generations. So that means that you could use a slightly older motherboard, of course make sure that it is compatible. And at that point, if you do have a motherboard that's a few years old, you could take out the old processor, put this one in, Make sure that you look for the newest firmware for the motherboard to make sure that it is 100% compatible to this um, amazing new processor. The other things that uh, we'll be discussing in future videos is we'll be putting on a liquid cooling uh, system called the Kraken X53. And the other thing too that is uh, of note is the motherboard into which this fits supports, thanks to the processor, uh, and the motherboard in combination, of course, uh, PCIe version 4, which is the newest one. It'll allow us to have faster storage on NVMe drives, which I've mentioned in numerous videos. So the chipset that we'll be using in combination with this processor is the X570. It's an AMD chipset, of course, and that is found on the motherboard. We'll see that later with the motherboard. I'm Bob Pelley and CTO Bob. Hope you've enjoyed this video. You can visit us at www.ctobob.com. Thanks for watching.